While the debate is still out there in regards to how much money Black Widow is going to make this opening weekend and what type of numbers it can pull off considering that Disney Plus is a major factor, it's a pretty good indicator that it's going to find its footing at least in the early going because Black Widow advanced ticket sales according to Fandango are the best so far. So as reports have been saying, yes, Fandango published their ticket sales. And according to them, yeah, Black Widow is doing tremendously well. It's managed to sell the most advanced tickets over the course of the last year. Now, what exactly that means, you know, not much in the grand scheme of things, considering there's only been like, what, Fast and Furious or Fast 9, Mortal Kombat and Godzilla vs. Kong. And last year, there wasn't much after Birds of Prey, really. Maybe there was Bloodshot, I think, and that's it. But it's still a good indicator that this thing will be able to drive some, uh, you know, engagement with fans. Now, I should also say this, because it needs to be said. Just because a movie has high ticket sale pre-orders, it doesn't mean anything. I just want to make that very clear. You guys will remember, some of you might be new and you might not. Batman v Superman pre-ticket sales were outselling Civil War like 5 to 1. But which movie made more money in the box office and in its opening weekend? Again, you know, you have to be careful with this because it's a bubble. It's a vacuum. You're talking to the most dedicated and sometimes they will push this as, oh, look at all the tickets we bought and you get the numbers, you're like, oh, well, clearly, but the most hardcore fans are buying it. Typical people, they're going to show up at the theater and go, eh, I'm going to see Black Widow this weekend. I didn't know it was out. Well, I'll get on Disney+. Plus. It's that type of scenario here. But I think this is a good indicator that this film isn't going to do as terrible as some people are saying. Which some people were like, oh, it's going to flop. It's going to make $75 million. It's going to flop with $75 million. Flop with $75 million. Okay, well... Because that's the territory we're in now. So you see what I'm saying? Uh, I think it's going to do pretty well. Obviously, it's a different market now. Things have changed. We got to wait and see. We got to see the Disney Plus effect. As I always keep telling people, Samba TV will have some reports within a week. And we're going to have like that bigger picture of it. And then when somebody's going to crunch the numbers, somebody really smart and go, well, this is how much. This is how much goes here to this and that. And we're going to get a good picture of what this does. But so far, if you go at least by these statics, people are excited to go back. And I know I checked my local theater just to see how it is before, you know, the first weekend showings. Because, again, they're slowly opening up screens. They're filling up. So I think people are ready to get back to it. And a lot of people are doing what I'm doing. This is my first film back in theaters. So with that in mind, did you guys pre-order your tickets? Or are you doing the Disney Plus thing? I'm doing both because obviously.